Alright guys, this is System Test 21, so let's get started. So the panel says, hashtag fire panels are cool. Because they are. <laughs> Alright, let's get started with the pull stations. Pull stations one. Pull station one, I have my um, Game Well Century local alarm version. Very rare and very cool pull station, I think. And then pull station two was given to me by Frank Daugherty. I know he wanted to be in this test, but um, I just don't have any time to call him at all. Um, but it is um, the Gamewell M69. Um, thank you very much for that. It's a really cool and also rare pull station, I think. Um, and notice both of, the, both of the pull stations are Gamewell. Key switches are both the same. The enunciator is the same. This pull station is the same. I will try and demonstrate it in this test or the next test or a different video. Going up, we have the same smoke detector, but I did change um, the other device out to a system sensor i3. I think the it was originally this, and now it's an i3. So we'll try and test that out today. And now the alarms are really cool. I have a Wheelock EH-DL1-WM-24. Um, and that is set to, uh, March time. And then a really interesting device, which I bet none of you are expecting, is a Gentex bell. Yeah, it's a huge Gentex bell. Um, I think it's like six or seven or eight inch bell, I'm not sure. Um, but it's a huge bell, um, 96 decibels. It is set to code three. So let's get started. So today we will start with the game wall century. Here we go in three, two, one. Zone 1, Gamewell Sentry. Um, there is audible silence on the Wheelock EH-DL1 because um, it's a four-wire device. So now we'll demonstrate this other pull station here, the Gamewell M69. And this pull station is really, really hard to pull. You might have seen some videos from other YouTube users about how hard to pull this one is, but it is seriously really hard to pull. I didn't think it would be that hard, but it actually really is that hard to pull. Um, let's say it's maybe like probably more than 10 pounds pull force. And just to demonstrate that, I know this isn't the smartest idea, but watch this. So normally you would think by hitting a hammer on a pull station that the pull station would at least activate, but it only went down probably about a half inch. So that's how hard it is to pull. So now, we will pull it. <laughs> now going up here, we will activate the system sensor I3 just by uh, using the test button on it. So, three, two, one. So now on to resetting the game wall sentry here. It's just a matter of unscrewing the screw at the top. And uh, once you do that, the pull station just kind of flies down. And then you flip the switch back to normal, and then you put it back up, closing the pull lever, and then you screw it back in. Okay, and right here with this pull station, you just kind of stick like a long hex key or something um, into that little hole right there. And then push in, and it pushes in on a button back in there. That button right there, it pushes it in, which frees this little piece right here. Um, it's metal, and then just kind of slide it back in the top and push down, and it's reset. 
And then after that, we can go ahead and reset from our enunciator. All right, and then one more thing before I go, I did promise I would demonstrate um, this part of the system. So uh, here we go. And nothing really has changed since I last demonstrated it demonstrated it in system test one but if you weren't there for that um i highly recommend going check going and checking it out but a little background information this is basically like an emergency pull station and when i pull it the panel will start saying hazard alert none of these will sound but this ceiling mount commander floor with a blue strobe over there will sound so let's go ahead and pull it Focus, there we go. All right, we can go ahead and set the pull. And then reset. And I think that is the video. And you might be hearing like a vacuum cleaner. That's because we're vacuuming upstairs right now. <laughs> so yeah, that is the video. Um, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And have a great day.